Hey everyone, <clears throat> so today I'll be going over this uh, rocket vacuum. This is a good uh, corded vacuum uh, for the home. Uh, let me actually kind of set it like this. Might be better for you guys to see. So if you can see here, oops. There we go, man, that looks better. There we go. Okay, so if you notice right here, this vacuum is able to kind of move up and down, swivel up and down. Uh, if you need to get into hard to reach places, this is the rocket vacuum by Shark. Obviously, you know, you like their marketing there. First most recommended br recommended vacuum brand. And uh, once you start using it, you'll see why. It's a really good product. The price-wise is actually a little on the medium side, but kind of uh, go over this. So to start off that, this actually comes, I think in different colors. It actually comes in a, in a blue accent, if that matters to you. At this point, I think, I'm not sure if the prices, if the prices are determined by what color scheme they are, but if they are, and if it doesn't matter to you, just go ahead and just get the cheaper color at that point. So start off right here. Show you guys how everything kind of works. So this guy is just gonna move up right like that. That's where it's just gonna be seated. If you notice, it's not gonna be too terribly big, so it'll be relatively compact uh, when it goes in. Um, so what you do is, in order for all of this to function correctly, you actually need to take the main unit here and attach this guy. Oops. Show you guys where it goes. Attach him here, right? Bring him down. And then you usually hear a click. Oh, hold on. There you go. As, so as soon as you guys hear that click, then you're ready to go. And you kind of just put this down and then you start to pretty much go and back in from there. What you're gonna want to do is when you're done with it, make sure not to leave it upright like this because this is top heavy and you will break that leg there. And then when you're ready to let it go, you just press this button right here. And you're ready. Let me just take it. Okay, there we go. Alrighty, so one thing that's nice about this is that obviously it's very portable. It's not it's not clunky like most like most vacuums are. And uh, this little guy here, like I showed you guys earlier, this will actually come down, and you can go into hard to reach places. This here, as you know, you can release. You can actually release the nozzle here. Uh, it's actually not coming out because this is tied in. So what you can do is you can actually take this little pipe, put this into here, and, it, and use the several little tools that come with it. The tools that come with it are gonna be this small little guy here that goes into hard to reach places. You're gonna have your basic brush, right? And this guy here, I think this is for like the carpet, I believe. Uh, in any case, uh, one thing I do wanna uh, kinda remind you guys, kinda point out is that this guy here, and as you can tell, it's already taped for you guys. We actually have fixed it so that way it doesn't break anymore. This is actually susceptible to breaking. And uh, if you do want to get another piece, I think it's like about like $10. At which point, I mean, depending on your budget, probably not worth it. You can also, instead of using this whole pipe, you can actually even just plug this directly here. And this becomes something a little more portable. So you can use this for the car. Uh, just make sure you have your extensions. You can use this for the car. You can use this for uh, if it's like a small room, just depending on, you know, whether or not you want to bend down, you know, and go from there. So just kind of go over this little main guy here. It's going to have two speeds. One is, see, they kind of tell you barefoot or area rugs and the other's going to be high pile carpets. To tell you the truth, I always just go on the second speed anyways, just to kind of get everything done quicker. But that's just me. You can uh, adjust and see how that works out differently. When you are ready to clean this, as you can tell, it's already been cleaned, uh, but when you are ready to clean it it's uh, go ahead and pull this out here and it does have a nice little filter here you can actually oh yeah that's right so you, then you just empty it out pretty much and then this guy right here actually you can take him out and then you can actually wash that part there um, so that way oof, oof. Oops, that probably wasn't a good idea. Okay, so that way you kind of don't get the excess dirt on you anymore um, so you put this guy back here and put him back And then you're pretty much done with that. Um, and then when you want to uh, go ahead and take out the filter, uh, this main little guy there, you just flip it over. And then you just pull it out. And then see, there you go, you're good to go. What's nice obviously is that you don't really have to buy replacement parts for, for it. In that sense, you kind of just throw it out and you can clean that filter that I showed you earlier. Um, it's nice, it's compact, it's relatively light. Uh, it's corded, so obviously it's not gonna give you the same functionality as a cordless. A vacuum but it is gonna get the job done it's gonna be really quick uh, and you could empty out very quickly so once again this is the shark rocket uh, vacuum and uh, thanks for listening all right